Can a massage practitioner do deep pressure on a bruise? Okay, so let's go ahead and put your arm out. The answer is it depends. So if, a, if you see a patient that has a bruise, let's say right here, and you see inflammation, like you see it like it's puffiness from water, or you put your hand on it and you feel heat, you see the presence of heat and red swelling, then no, you do not touch it. That would be contraindicated, right? But if all it is is discoloration, then all you have to do is do superficial gliding, cross fiber friction, and you can do it really, really fast. And that'll help remove the bad blood and drive in good blood, okay? Because people are concerned about that. Bring in the good blood, help that interstitial fluid move, help those muscles to heal. You can, and as the, the patient comes more and more, you can go deeper and deeper. But in the, initially, you don't want to use too much ischemic pressure. You don't want to do any striking. Basically, you just want to get in there and move that bad blood, help restore good uh, blood in there, and you should be fine. Does that, does that answer your question? It did. Thank you very much.